I mean, I, as a young man, I basically did two things. Uh, as a sort of very young boy, actually, I was a fairly active Boy Scout. I learned a lot of things uh, about how to interact in small groups and how to survive in, <laughs> in the cold Scandinavian winter. Uh, then later on, in my later teens, I was very active in leftist politics and uh, for a couple of years until I decided this was a really stupid idea. So I've, I've learned a lot from those years, and I think it's very important for any young person to be active in, in those kinds of environments. I'm not suggesting everybody goes into politics, but going into stuff which sort of adds on to your, your academic curriculum or whatever, I think is very important. I tend to think that, that activities such as scouting, and of course there are other similar activities, particularly scouting perhaps, contributes greatly to, to your ability to, to sort of make it in an organization. The importance of honesty enough, I think it's extremely important that you don't try to mislead the people who you work with. Then there's one more thing I think, I think I'd like to point to, particularly as it uh, relates to the dark Scandinavian winter. Uh, you need to develop a um, strong sense of your own abilities. You need to become... Uh, uh, you, you need to really start trusting yourself. You need to develop a, a, um, a strong belief in your ability to pull through in difficult situations and circumstances. And uh, if there's anything, I think particularly the dark Scandinavian winter and the low temperatures and skiing about somewhere uh, in the wilderness teaches you is that uh, you can get through. Uh, that uh, you're actually able to do quite a number of things you perhaps we're not quite sure you would be able to do. I think that matters a lot in, in business as well, because particularly in the sort of early to mid stages of, of business careers, you are, if you're moving ahead, you will be facing a lot of situations where you're sort of pushing the limits of your abilities. And in those situations where you're pushing the limits of your abilities, it's very good to know that you've been there before. Perhaps not in exactly the same situation, but in a very similar one. Absolutely. But what you would like to see scouting do in the next uh, 10, 20 years? Well, I think it should broadly continue doing what it is doing best. And that, of course, is on one hand providing the most ambi ambitious young people with uh, an opportunity to prove themselves and to learn the skills to take themselves to to where they want to be going. Uh, but it also, of course, does another thing, and that is that it helps the people, the younger people, who are on the verge of losing track of, of, of direction. And as a consequence, it offers them a, a direction and uh, probably also the means to stay on that course.